playing all alone, don't feel cool, join your friends in the tide pool. Greetings gamer folk, we are back, it's Tide Lot Gaming, and Aaron. And Michael, welcome back. And back at Subnautica. Yeah. Uh, up, if you can. That's a cute little cave though. Yeah. That was nice. Yeah, and then and then I saw the water again, and all the joy went away. <laughs> hey, but that was a cute little cave. Okay. Yeah, um, so if you get up on top of that ridge right there. Um, should go right up. Yeah, I think there's another. It's like, yeah, there you go. Climbing those shitty mountains in the barrens. Yes. Eventually you find something you're looking for. So that blue tablet you got up, mm -hmm. or picked up, they, uh, they open alien doors and... Um, Force fields and stuff. So. Oh, the the purple tablet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what it's for. And if you do well enough, uh, you don't have to end up making any more of them. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, I think you only have to make one tablet to end up beating the game. All right. Yeah, we're almost there. Yeah. Up, 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 up. The big ship. Yeah, it is. So look over, uh, look back at the aurora, and then keep going left. Weird. What? There's another island over there. In my game, it, there's always like a a blur. Maybe the view distance is further on your... Oh, yeah, good point. Yeah, I guess all that shit's fixed on a console. Yeah. Anyway, um, yeah, so you can scan those pots. Oh, marble melon. Yeah, um, knife that Okay. once you scan the pot. And you're just scanning the fruit right now. Oh no, you weren't. Okay. Yeah. So knife the plant, and you'll get seed. Perfect. So seeds don't go bad, oh, and potato. you can plant those. Yeah. Who doesn't need a swivel chair? You know. Oh yeah. Well, you know, you have to build an observatory thing like this, yeah. and then put the swivel chair in there just so that you can be like the fucking emperor. Yeah. Swivel and look at the expanse. Okay, that is it. So, I found that the marble melons give you the best health and food. Or, I'm sorry, water and food. Okay. So, all I ever do is make some interior grow beds and just fill, fill them up with uh, marble melons. Okay. And then you're pretty much always good to go. So, um, yeah, back to the uh, your life pod, and you can start looking for a place to build a base now that you have the uh Let me these give me some water too, right? Um. They're oh. old, so not anymore. Oh, okay. So you can just drop them. I'm just... Uh, I'm not doing that bad on... No, no, you can make it back, for sure. But you'll have to get you some bladder fish. As soon as we get back to, like, Happy Reef territory again, it won't be so difficult. Like, you playing the game? Well, me do doing anything in the water aside from going straight and wincing. Oh, okay. But it'll be easier on the way back, because you'll have the uh, life pod indicator. Oh, what's that little blip? Blip. Oh, okay, that's sort of the life pod. So when you get back, you can cut over. But you don't want to go straight toward that, I don't think. you already been up there. Well, yeah, I'm trying to line up more with the... Oh, any place is good. There's nothing dangerous right here. I found that the, the Leviathans, except for like the story ones, are only like in places you shouldn't be. Like the uh, Reapers. Monkey? I don't think so. Oh, I'm seeing shit now. Yeah. Oh, it's getting to you. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm terrified beyond the capacity for rational thought. <laughs> <laughs> it just gets worse. Sorry. That's alright. I, I agreed to this. Yeah. And it's a really cool game. Like, I know you don't like the sea. That's the problem. I love the sea. You can probably make that. It may hurt a little bit, but you're not going to die. There you go. Um, the terrifying creatures and unknown of the deep. But it's really fun. Like I said, all you got to do is line your little crosshair up with the pod and go straight at it. Like, maybe like a meter below so the sea glide actually works. Yeah, you got enough battery to get back. 
There you go. Just kind of point right at it and boogie. So right below us right now and everything, yeah, mm -hmm. we're going to be down here a lot. It's um, a good entrance to the underwater river or the lost river, whatever they call it. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's how you get into the final parts of the game, going down okay. through that. And um, yeah. I'm also refusing to look in any direction. No, it's all good. Better to not know. Especially down. Now there are those big um, reef back leviathans mm -hmm. that are non-hostile and you'll probably see those floating around. The big tentacles will show up on the screen. Watch your uh, O2 there. Yeah. Okay. See, there's one now. He's fine. Oh, yeah, no, they're docile. Why does it know if you'd be like, ah! <laughs> well, no, that's there's something it, in the water! No, it looks like a rock with tentacles. I'm fine. Okay. You know what the bone sharks are? I have seen pictures of them. Okay. Just when we start exploring some of the wrecks further down, they uh, they tend to kind of pop out. Oh yeah, they'll pop out. I'll scream, and you know. <laughs> critical state. Okay. Okay. So let's look for some bladder fish. Yeah. There's some peepers. What the hell was that? Oh, uh, bladder fish. Where, where, where'd it go? I don't know. Right there. There's one. There's another one. There's two. <laughs> Come here, motherfucker. Let me get one more. Okay. Uh, air. You know, it's actually probably a good thing I'm telling you so much because I think you're focusing so much on not being scared. Yeah, I, I would not. Oh, right, 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 right. Uh, keep going right. There he is. I would not be doing anything remotely effective. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. Hopefully, you're, you'll relax a little bit. Oh, there's I think a couple messages. Yeah. Um. Once you see how the game is, it's just, it's fun. I really enjoyed it. Well, we can start building a base now, right? Yes. All right. So, do you want to find where you want to build a base? What do you mean? Like, you can really build it fucking anywhere. Um, I would just suggest to build it on the island side of the reef. Because when the aurora explodes, it'll be all radiation over there. The first time I played, I didn't realize that because I was wearing a radiation suit mm -hmm. and I built my fucking base in the middle of a radiation zone and uh, I had to fucking wear it to go into my own base oh that sounds lovely yeah so we'll plant those once we build the base okay um, but go ahead and chug some of that water to them um, and pick up some of the um, titanium from that box so basically everything you build takes titanium for okay. the uh, the base. I'd grab all of it and those two quarts. There's one more up there. Oh, there's oh yeah. Oh yeah, I see it up top. There you go. All right. Okay. Right. Any ideas? So you said on the island side of the aurora? Yeah. So... Okay, yeah. So, over there. Like, just on the that side of the reef. I thought I was going to get both of them right okay. there. Uh, cut, pop up. Look, look over to the thingy. The aurora. Okay. Yeah, uh, hang a little more right. No, not that far, Jesus. Like, go left and get underwater so I can see. Uh, left. G go that way, kind of toward where the everything starts falling off. I think that's the edge. There should be an area over there that's all, like, red grass. Okay. 
more right. There you go. Kind of head out that way. I can't build it like in here. You can. You just need a little bit of a flat space, uh -huh. and then enough like clear surroundings to get the sea moth in and out and the cyclops when you make it. So you really shouldn't build it too shallow. Mm -hmm. um, so kind of on the edge of a drop off. Let me let me kind of show you where I build it. Okay. See what you think. So uh, go uh, pop up again. I'm sorry. Find the uh, aurora. Okay, and right, 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 right. Right, go that way. And you should start seeing um, like a drop off and like a bunch of white sand and little red uh, grass. But there's nothing dangerous in here except those little uh, barracuda looking dudes. Okay, look down. Okay. So look back toward the reef. More, more right, I'm sorry. Right. Right, 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 right. Okay, I think up in there is where I tend to build. Yeah, there's those two floaty rocks. So I usually build my base right here on that shelf. Okay. And that way I can drive in from the uh, abyss and all that, and it's all good. 30 seconds. Oh. So if you think that's a good spot. I, I'll, I'll follow instructions on this one. I'm Okay. All right, so you just whip out your uh, base builder, okay, and find out how to use it. I don't know what button it is. You know, it'll pop up a menu. What are you doing? I uh, thought I heard something. No, no, nothing will come over here, except the uh, uh, the butt guys that shoot the poison. All right, so are we starting with a foundation? No, you don't need to build that. Um, a multi-purpose room. Yep. Six fifteen. Okay. So you'll just kind of get that close to the edge. Um, so if you just click once, okay, it went away. Um, so it's a different button to start building. Like that? Yeah. Let me... <laughs> yeah, you'll get used to the moving. Movementation. Now, of course, it's goddamn nighttime. There you go. Try that. So it's kind of okay. Now stop. Swim up to where you can get a better view of it. Kind of go around uh, toward the water a bit and look back at it. Okay. So you can kind of see better where it's positioned because it's right in your fucking face. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, so um, that's fine. Yeah, I suppose you just want to have room to to build. Okay, so now you'll hold down A, I guess, is how you construct, and it'll slowly use the six titanium that it takes. Okay, and it's done. So now you need to add a, a uh, hatch to it. Yeah. She's got good advice. <laughs> okay. I guess we'll put the hatch on this side? Um, no. no. You want to put it on the cliff side. Okay. Because you'll be able to build back toward us. More. Okay. So probably right there on that. That's right there, yep. So it'll be this one and then hatch. It's uh, right over there, yep. Hatch. Yep. And you already have the quartz, so move a little bit. Yeah, there you go. I just wanted to make sure it was lined up, so there you go. And you'll need to build some solar panels, which you may not have all the stuff for. And it's nighttime right now, so it won't charge. So at the top of the thing there, there's tabs. I have the quartz back at base. Okay. So you need to get some more copper. Um, how do I not lose this place? Uh, you'll have to build a beacon, um, which you can do at the fabricator. I think it's like a copper and a titanium. So you'll need to get copper anyway. So. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm sure we can eventually find it again. Oh, yeah. And uh, eventually when you get a little extra 
copper and uh, silver going on, you can build a compass and it shows up under your depth gauge. And you, it's just easier to kind of find your way like, oh shit, I'm east of whatever. Um, but yeah, you're going to find some mineral deposits and get some more copper. There's one. And it can't hurt to pick up the scrap right now because you're going to need so much building the base. Right. Did I pass scrap? No, I'm just saying if you see it. There's one. Um, don't feel like you need to pass it up. So the majority of those deposits are like on cliff faces and in the caves. Uh, Eric, I know you don't like going in the caves, but the best place. Oh, what about that tube behind you? No, I think it was a bigger one. There you go. I'm fine with caves, because, I mean, like, how big can something in a cave possibly be? Well, just those fish pop out at you. No, this, this is not a problem. No, the quartz is good to get, too. Oh, yeah. You're going to be building some storage lockers. And it Glass. takes a couple quartz. Yeah. No, it just uses quartz. No, I'm saying, and, and glass. Yeah. I'll be making for windows. Titanium. All right. There's a copper. That's good. What's in here? More cave. Oh. That was weird. I don't think I've ever oh. seen one blocked off. Let me get that. Okay. Get that air. Is what I would say to you. Well, I thought it was raining for a second there. <laughs> All right, now your battery's getting low. That's I had that extra one. Yeah, yeah. I'm just saying, keep an eye on that. And uh, oh, message. Yeah, I didn't check them last time. We no. got a few. This is life pod six. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Six out. It sounds like such a mob. Approximate transmission origin recorded to data bank. All right. Yeah, see what it takes to, uh, under deployables to make a beacon. Oh, you haven't found the pieces yet. You have to scan that. It'll be uh, around wreckage. Sorry. Okay. Um, so what else did we need to make? Okay, it'll be a minute before you can get that rock. Damn it. Uh, magnetite or whatever it is. Anything to make myself feel a little safer? Yeah. I don't think the... Well, I know the stasis gun doesn't actually do damage. It just kind of holds them in this bubble. Hey, if they're... But yeah, it's a time to get away. Alright, what, so what am I building? Um, For the solar panels? Uh, bring up your inventory. Um, see at the top that wrench? Okay, that shows you all your schematics. So you can find um, base stuff is toward the bottom. Oops, see, Moth. <laughs> um, keep it going. Am I already using these, or no? You can't make those yet till you have a modification station. And lithium. And lithium. Yep. Okay, solar panel. There you go. All right, so you need two quartz, two titanium, one copper for each one, and you okay. should probably build at least two. So what do you have? Uh, in my inventory right now. God, wrong button. All right, copper, copper, copper. Okay, quartz, you got enough. Yeah. Cool. Um, yeah, so I guess you can boogie back over there. Oh, sweet, and daylight's coming in. So over where the base is. All right, so let me let me see if I can figure this out on my own okay. this time. Uh, if the aurora is there, mm -hmm. the base is this way. Yeah, right in there somewhere. Um, I think over where our, your base is going to be, I, there's some crashes that may have the, the uh, buoy fragments. Okay. All right, I remember these guys. Mm -hmm. This really is a beautiful game. I know I keep saying that, but it's so nice. No, no, no. It re re oh, there we go. Exchange. Yeah. There we go. Okay, that's one of the crashes. That's that thing. Yeah. All right, we're going to have to... He seems busy. Yeah, kind of sneak in. 
closed. Now the buoys are usually just lay in there, and they look like a little uh, oval with some floaties attached to it, like little life jackets. Nothing. Nope. And he's seen me. <laughs> But you were on the right track there. Um, if you follow that ridge to the left, you'll run right into it. Wait, there's something laying on the ground there. Right under him. See it? Yep. You can probably just strafe out of his way. That's a buoy fragment. Beacon. Sorry. Alright, get out of there! Nap, see it? Alright, so you can just slap those on top of your module, and uh, you'll have power in there. Which is good. Because yes. power means life. Yes, indeed. Just like this? Yeah. Let's, let's do this. 30 seconds. Isn't that so satisfying? I can't wait till people actually invent that shit. <laughs> oh, you could have just gone on your new base. Right. And you can build another one up top, just to have a little bit of power reserves. Yep. Oh, that's cool, you can rotate yours with uh, whatever buttons it said there. Alright. Um, oh, it was one of those... Uh, reef backs, yeah. yeah. Um, you should probably go and attach a couple more multi-purpose rooms. How much titanium do you have? Yeah, okay. Uh, I wouldn't use it all. Um, well, I mean, I can always go back to base and get more. Yeah, H hop in there, though, for air's yeah. sake. Alright, and then next time on Tidal Lock, we will look at uh, what you need to build a fabricator and all that, so you oh, don't have to fancy. keep running back. Yeah, all right. nice. A lot bigger on the inside, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Alright.